Hello, Portsmouth Trojans. This is Josh Morris from Portsmouth City School. I wanted to spend just a few minutes updating our, our Trojan families of what new, what is happening new within the Portsmouth City School District coming into this coming school year. We are doing a lot of new things with STEAM technology, and STEAM means science, technology, engineering, arts, and mathematics. We're going to spend just a few minutes highlighting several teachers throughout the district, letting you know the cool and awesome new things that they'll be doing within their classrooms this school year. Thank you. Hi, I'm April Deacon. I'm the high school art instructor at Portsmouth. Um, this year, we will be offering uh, an introduction to art class, two-dimensional art, um, AP Studio 2D art, and art and community courses. We'll be offering those both virtually and in person. Um, I'm really excited this year about a couple of things. One, uh, in the past five years, we've worked with nine different visiting artists. And this year we'll be hosting another, thanks to the Ohio Arts Council. Um, we will welcome theater professor Tom Dugdale from Ohio State University. And he will be working with the art and community class in order to create an original play based upon their lives. Um, and we'll also do some set design. Additionally, we are working on some STEAM for the art classroom. We're going to be looking at some laser printers and uh, 3D printers as a way to collaborate with other classrooms. Hi, I'm Mr. Will at Portsmouth High School. This year in the wood shop, we'll be doing Woods One, which is just a general basic introduction to woodworking. Uh, we'll also do Woods Two, which is advanced woodworking. We'll do more hands-on work in the shop. Uh, also, a new class this year in woodworking is uh, the wood shop economy. In that class, we're going to learn more about production flow and setting things up to make a profit. Also, this year I'll be teaching a robotics class here at the high school. Uh, in the robotics class, we'll be doing a lot of engineering, uh, well, everything with STEAM really. Uh, you'll need to know a lot about math, science, bring your creativity to class with you. Uh, at the end of the year, there's going to be a national competition where students will build and design a robot. Uh, to go compete against other schools. Uh, so that's some of the fun and exciting things we have going on here at the high school this year. Hi, I'm Jenny Dutton. I work at Portsmouth Elementary School in the library. One of the exciting parts about being in the library is that we also teach computer skills in the library, including coding. We use a number of products to teach block coding to our children. One product teaches block coding to the younger kindergarten through second graders called Kibo. It's a little robot where they scan the program in and learn Block coding through that method. Um, for the older students, we have a robot called Spiro. Spiro is a robot that is controlled by Chromebooks. They use block coding in order to tell the robot what to do and learn basic commands as far as coding goes. Good morning, this is Mr. Cole. I teach at PHS 9 through 12, um, primarily juniors and seniors, they seem to have the most of. Uh, we have a lot of fun in our classes, and they are very creative classes. They definitely are the STEAM type of classes and have been. Um, I teach graphic design, which is sort of artwork on the computer, but it's also the whole business side, marketing and advertising and all the cool stuff you can do with graphics and motion graphics. We also get into product design. Anything you see in a Walmart store, cars, toys, Anything that you could go and spend money on or new inventions, that's all product design. We do a lot of cool stuff there. We're getting a brand new 3D printer, state of the art, which will be awesome. The kids will get to kind of print and make the things that they can create. We also have cricket makers and those type of things. And 3D software on the computers. Um, we also have video production. Learn to make videos, create videos. Um, for, whether it's for social media or a commercial or a public service announcement or a short film or a short movie. Um, students will be able to do a lot of really cool creative things in video production class. We have a brand new Mac lab in my room which we'll be showing later and the students will have Macs for the first time and that should be very interesting. I think all the students are really going to like that. So this should be an interesting year. It'll be different than most years but it should be great. Thanks.